Hi everybody. Welcome to Universe View Odyssey channel. Dialogue concerning the curved space drawn by Einstein's thought experiment. Q1. In the last video, you explained the process of deriving curved space through Einstein's rotating disk thought experiment. Before introducing the pictures of curved space, can you explain the main points of the rotating disk thought experiment for subscriber who did not watch last video? That would be nice. This was inspired by the Ehrenfest's paradox, which states that the circumference of a rotating disk decreases due to the Lorentzian contraction, resulting in a smaller circumference. If you read the scale of the clock placed here and there on the rotating disk, the contents are different in each place, due to the time delay effect. And if you measure the length of the circumference of the disk with a measuring rod, the pi ratio pi is different in each place, due to the measuring rod contraction. The fact that the pi, circumference, diameter, of different parts of the rotating disk is different means that the disk is not flat but curved. Here Einstein applies the equivalence principle. The equivalence principle states that the effect of acceleration is the same as the effect of gravity. So rotation is an acceleration because the direction of the speed keeps changing. So, if the accelerating disk is curved, we can infer that the disk in the gravitational field, which is affected by gravity according to the equivalence principle, is curved. In the end, while thinking about how to mathematically express the shape of space affected by the gravitational field, the curved space, or the curvature of space, Einstein first imagined a picture of such a curved space. Q2. I can tell visually that the plane is curved, but how do I know that space is curved? Even Einstein would have a hard time drawing this. How can we know the structure of empty space? The curvature of outer space seems difficult to visualize by any human imagination. But what if an electromagnetic field pervaded that space? Couldn't it be possible to guess the structure of the electric field through the movement of charged particles flowing into the electric field? Q3. Oh, I see. Then, by what material can we know the structure of the space where the gravitational field is spread? You have to think about what is affected by gravity, right? In the previous video, we introduced the thought experiment that gravity bends light, right? Q4. Oh, I see. Maybe we can shoot light into space where the gravitational field is spread out. We can understand the structure of the space by looking at whether the light goes straight or bends and how it bends. Greater than exactly. Einstein predicted that a massive star would bend the light path, and this was confirmed experimentally. In some places, the light disappears. It's probably a black hole. Q5. Where gravity is high, the degree of bending of light is large, so the space is curved a lot in that place. Is it like this? That's it. But here Einstein makes an important declaration. There is no gravity. There is only the curvature of space. Q6. What does this mean? Einstein has been talking about the role of gravity, such as delaying time and bending light, from the equivalence principle. And now who would believe that there is no gravity? It deserves such a reaction. Now, to understand the true meaning of Einstein's statement, consider this example. Let's consider the case of light bending around a star. This can be interpreted in Newtonian terms as the result of the gravity created by the mass of the star catching the light. But Einstein interpreted that the star created a curved space, and that light travels the shortest path in that space, but it appears to us that the light is curved. Light always travels along the shortest path, geodesic, in space. At this time, the effect of gravity can be replaced by the curvature of space, so, gravity, is an unnecessary virtual concept. Q7. Ah, that's what it means. Einstein abandoned the concept of gravity while drawing a picture of the curvature of space. Matter does not produce gravity, but form the curvature of space. This is the central conclusion of the general theory of relativity. Q8. Matter does not create gravity, it forms the curvature of space. This seems to be the essence of general relativity. 
Now, let's get into the main topic and learn about the picture of the curved space imagined by Einstein. Now, imagine a woven fabric with soft and elastic yarn. Several people lift and pull this fabric to spread it flat. Place a bowling ball on top of it. Then the part of the fabric on which the bowling ball placed will be dented. Roll a small marble around it. The marble will either roll straight down towards the bowling ball or roll down a slightly curved path. Now, assuming that the fabric is transparent, let's imagine a bunch of marbles rolling around in all directions around a bowling ball. Can't you picture the structure of the space around the bowling ball? Q9. I guess I can barely outline it. Now, imagine that you suddenly remove the bowling ball from the fabric. What will happen? The surface of the fabric returns to the original state with a wave-like wave, and this wave spreads along the fabric and reaches the fingertips of the people holding it. Likewise, if the sun suddenly disappears at any moment, it will create a shock wave in the curved space, which will spread through space at the speed of light. Einstein predicted gravitational waves through this imagination. He predicted that the gravitational waves would propagate at the same speed as the speed of light, not immediately like Newton's. This was actually detected in 2015. In fact, Newton himself confessed that although he explained the movement of celestial bodies through the law of universal gravitation in open hollow corner bracket Principia close hollow corner bracket, he could not reveal the cause of the mysterious gravity that acts instantly throughout the universe. Finally, Einstein was able to explain the cause of gravity that Newton could not reveal. That is the curvature of space-time. Thanks for watching. You can read this story in Injury Time, injurytime.kr.